Hey, what's up? It's your girl, Diamond Denisha, aka Didi, and this is my YouTube channel, Didi Said So, and I am back with another video. So, today, today, today is Friday, and it's a coupon video. Y'all, we haven't been couponing since like I think July 4th was the last time that I went, and it's already what I don't know what day it is. It's like July 20 something, July 23rd or something like that. But, um, quick disclaimer I was able to claim like some back to school free offers i'm not sure how you get it so if you're new i'm not sure how to tell you how to get it but you have to like opt into ibotta's um ex web web extension or something and then it'll become available on your account so i was able to get four out of the six freebies i think it was today i remembered my gift card even though it was not much i got a bunch of items i normally have my receipt but this is like the one time i don't have my receipt i think i got like a roughly around 29 32 items so as per usual, um, also if you haven't seen my last video, my last video, I wish I could do it like where I'm gonna pop it up right here. My last video, um, I did a single swag unboxing, so I'll be bringing one video a month with my single swag. I'm still holding on to my last two nails for my birthday, birthday nails, and I'll be bringing a birthday gift unboxing video hopefully soon whenever I get all my gifts together. But let's get into the video. So the first item I got. With the Skippy peanut butter, this was two eighteen. I bought it, gave me back two fifty four, making it completely free and a thirty six cent money maker. And what's peanut butter without jelly? I got the Smucker's squeeze the grape jelly because who likes strawberry? If you like strawberry, write it in the comments. If you like strawberry or grape jelly better, I like grape. This was two. Oh, I I said it backwards. This was the two eighteen and um. I bought a game back two fifty four, making it thirty six cent. The peanut butter was two thirty four. I bought a game back two fifty three, making it nineteen cent money maker. So I already had a mix up, but we gonna keep on going. I could not find the pencils, but I did find the erasers. The erasers was one thirty four. I bought a game back one thirty nine, making it free plus a five cent money maker. And then what the, what's saying? I forgot. I forgot the saying. Last but not least, um, the Kleenex was one fifty eight. Uh, about to give me back 189 making the final cost 31 cent so those are the little couple of freebies that i got so let's move on into the items so i had to do this deal again as long as it keep coming back i'm gonna keep getting my water so i got the nestle splash water these were 167 and i got three because on my account you need to get three to get the to get the offer this is the icy grape but i found and i got two icy grapes and I also found the mandarin orange. So I'm excited to try the mandarin orange. And I'm pretty sure my family's going to drink it before I get to try it. But they also have lemon and mixed berry. But my store didn't have it today. So that's how that went. The next item that I have for you is cereal, y'all. I got cereal wasted. Your girl got cereal wasted. So we got the Cosmic Brownie cereal. So they finally gave us a $1 internet printable. I told you that you can print coupons for free for on coupons.com. But I print coupons through Swagbucks, Inbox Dollars, and My Points. And I will leave all of my referral links for all of those three sites below if you want to sign up and print coupons and get paid to print coupons. This was $3.64. I had a $1 coupon. Um, paid $2.64 at the store. Got back a dollar from Ibotta, making the final cost one sixty four. Because of all the cereal that I got, I do plan on doing like a cereal tasting, like Kellogg's versus General Mills. But we'll cross that bridge when we get to it. The next one I got, I finally found this. I went to like three or four different stores. I kept seeing other YouTubers and under other couponers saying that they found the cereal, but I finally found it. This is the Frosted Flakes Center basketballs. Just look how it looks. Um. This was three dollars and sixty four cents. I also had a dollar coupon. Oh, I apologize. These coupons came from Kellogg's Family Rewards. These was the two coupons that came from Kellogg's Family Rewards, which I will also link below. Um, I paid two dollars and sixty four cents. I got back a dollar from my body, but then there was also a forty cent any frosted flakes attaching, so it made the final cost one twenty four. So originally I had did all of these cereals separate, but then when I found out that I got a fetch fetch rebate. Um, I decided to like total it up and I normally do fetch later, but I'm gonna do it now. So I got the Jojo Siwa cereal. It says strawberry pop. So Jojo Siwa. And then I got the Cheerios Oat Crunch Almond. They also have the honey, but the I bought a rebate. It's only working for the almond. 
And then I got the Cinnamon Toast Douce de Leche. They also have a chocolate one, but the, the, again, the I bought a rebate. It's for the Douce de Leche. Um, they were all $3.64 each because they're all family size. There is a coupon for the Cheerios Oatmeal Crunch from the newspaper. I'm not sure which one. I'm going to get better at that. But I was actually saving that coupon for the Lucky Charms, which I did not see. So we're not going to worry about that. But for all three cereals, the total was $10.92. Got back $1.50 each from Ibotta. And then I got back $1 on Fetch for buying three, making the final cost $5.42 or just $1.80 each. And I'm going to try those cereals. I don't know if I'm going to try them all together or like split them up. But we have that. The next item that I have for you, okay, that one's gone, is. Ba, 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 the Freshly, Mrs. Freshly Make Life Sweeter Deluxe. These snacks, I haven't seen them on a lot of people videos and stuff, but I didn't get it. Like I said, I haven't been to um, Walmart since July 4th, so I apologize, but I'm going to get back on it. But these are the Reese's. They also have Oreo and Hershey's. This was $2.86. That was $1.50 internet printable from coupons.com. Um, paid $1.36, and I got back $1 from Ibotta, making the final cost $0.36. Cent. These just look like diabetes waiting to happen, but I'm definitely going to try it. And I'll probably take the rest of my co-workers. I, um, I'm so nice, y'all. I make this, like, snack bag that I take to my co-workers almost every Friday. So I haven't brought a snack bag in two weeks because I haven't been anywhere. But I hope they enjoy these that I'm going to throw in the snack bag today. The next item that I got is the all detergent. So this is the all Oxy, this is the blue one. There's a white one, there's a blue one. Get the blue one. The blue one was $2.97. That's a dollar fifty coupon, making it $1.36. And I bought it gives back a dollar, making the final cost $0.36. Cent. Now that now we do have coupons for the the white one as well, but there's no about a rebate. So get it at your own leisure. But there we have this. The next item I got was an item that I just stumbled upon sometimes. Um, I about to give you $0.25 cent for Pop Debbie $1. They did not, but I still wanted to get this. So the Dole Lemonade, um, the 2 liter, specifically the 2 liter, was $2.07. No, take that back. It was $1.78. And um, I about to give you back $0.25, cent, making the final cost one fifty three. So not the greatest for like a 2 liter or whatever, especially when you can get them for a dollar. But I want to try something new. So there we have it. The next item that I have for you, we got again and again and again, is the Can Do Flushable Wipes. Please do not flush these. I haven't heard of any great stories about people flushing it and actually went down. This is $188. I bought it, gave back $0.75, cents, making the final cost $113. The next item I got, which I was so glad to find, is a BOGO item, meaning that if you buy both products, I bought it, will give you BOGO. Like It's like buy one, get one free. They'll give you half the price of one back. So when I was looking, I found the hand sanitizer. So it actually works for multiple safeguard products. So when you're going through the Ibotta app, make sure that you look at the items that are eligible and make sure you're always scanning your products. So I had originally got the hand sanitizer until I seen the hand soaps. So this one says notes of lavender and this one says notes of citrus. And I think there was like a notes of coconut and a notes of lemon. This was $2.97 each, $5.94 for two. I paid that. I bought it, gave back three sixty seven, making the final cost three twenty seven. And I didn't do the math. Whatever three twenty seven divided by two, for all my math geniuses out there. And now I got some some hand soap. The next item I got is the Chic razors. So apparently we have um, coupons in our past Sunday's paper for this, but there's also coupons on coupons.com. Remember, I print through swag bucks and box dollars and my points. Um, and you can print coupons per day. Um, this was $5.97. Used a $3 paper coupon. Um, paid $2.97. I bought it, gave back $2, making the final cost $0.97. Cent. And, and it has like, I forgot what this is. It's not Lego. It's some type of game. I don't know what it is, but it has like a cool, um, like, QR code that you can scan and you probably get something for it. But, okay, those are the all of the Ibotta only items. We did fetch. We're going to move on to Shopkicks. So, today I got the Kellogg's Jumbo Snacks. Now, 
They have the Tiger Paws, which I think is like the Frosted Flakes. They have Apple Jacks. They have the Fruit Loops. Um, they have the Cinnabon, and they have these, the S'mores. So I'm excited to not only try it, but then again, throw it in my coworker's snack bag. You get 12 packs. It's $4.98. You use a $1 internet printable that you print from Kellogg's Family Rewards, which will be linked below. And you'll pay $3.98, but then Ibotta will give you back $2, and then Shopkicks will give you back $1.30, making the final cost $0.68 cent for 12 packs of snacks. But we're going to open it because I like to show you all, like, true to size what stuff looks like. I should have opened up the Mrs. Fresh Leaf. But, like, it's literally a snack. Like, like it's literally a snack. It's probably, like, like, eight or nine of them in here, but I'm excited to try it. Also, if you all have TikTok, I do have a TikTok where I try things um, on on my videos. Um, my TikTok name is Diamond Denisha. That's D-I-A-M-O-N-D-D-I-N-I-S-A. -D -D -I -I and if you're wondering, Denisha is my middle name without the H. I'll have to give y'all a story time on why my mom named me my middle name Denisha but took out the H. Stay tuned for that at another later time. The next one we have is the Fruity Pebbles Crisp. So I wanted to, I want to open these as well because I thought these was interesting. So they have the fruity pebbles and then it also has the cocoa pebbles. But I I grabbed the fruity pebbles because someone opened the cocoa pebbles and you don't want to take home stuff that's been open. You want to open it for yourself. So this is what it looked like and it's also gluten free. I be trying to find like gluten free products and plant based products just to try. Um, 140 calories for one pouch. They don't expire to January 2022. Um, for lots of fun things to yabba dabba do, you can go to pebblecereal.com. All right, post cereal. But these were um, $3.98. Um, Shop Kicks gave back $2.46 cents. Making the final cost one fifty two. I will also link the printable breakdown below with all of the all of the corrections and things. Sometimes I'll be scribbling all over, or sometimes the price is different in the store, so I don't have the final total for you. But when I have more time to thoroughly go over everything before my videos, I will. I do have to be at work later on today, so work with your girl. The next item that I have is the Quaker oatmeal. And it was, the deal was so good that I got all three flavors. The Quaker's Oatmeal. So, the Quaker's Oatmeal, like, if you have kids, I think this is something that's fun and something nice to do with them. So, they have the dinosaur eggs is one, one flavor. The s'mores. And then the scrawberry. Strawberry banana. Strawberry banana. Um, these are all 250 they're two fifty a piece, but I'll just go like break down as if I'm for one. But remember that you're paying two fifty for each. So it's two fifty. Um, shop kids give back a dollar and twenty four cent, and then um, I buy the gifts back seventy five cent up to five. So there's like different things with I buy the like um, if you purchase one item that counts as an offer, but if you, if you purchase that item three times, it only still counts as one offer. But there's like a little section on the I buy the account where it tells you how many times you can redeem. An offer meaning that I bought this three times so that I can get 75 cent back three times. And I could have done it five times, but I only needed it three. I hope that explained and helped somebody. If you have any if you have any coupon questions, you can feel free to pop them in the comments below. Or you can go follow me on Facebook on Coupon with DD, where I have a coupon group and I help people with their questions daily. I actually posted the printable breakdown well, I post the printable breakdown every Thursday before I go to Friday, and then I edit it for my YouTube videos for you all on Friday. But if you want a little bit more easier access, catch me on Facebook. The next item that I got was, was a bundle. I did like a bundle deal. So we know with Shopkicks you have to scan the larger items, but sometimes you can't purchase the trial sizes, and they'll give you the points back. So for this little guy... <laughs> I like to give my items genders. For this little guy, it was 97 cent. And for this little guy, it was 147. So this is the deodorant and this is the body wash. Together, they were 244. I bought a, sorry, Shop Kids gave back $4.32, making a final cost of $1.88 money maker. So if you just go and do this deal alone and don't do anything else, just go and do all the money maker deals. Go and do all the underdollar deals and money maker deals, and you'll come out on top. 
the next item that I have, I'm really excited for because I didn't get it last time. But the um, but the kicks increase was this Country Time Lemonade. So this is the powder where you can like make the um, make your Country Time Lemonade drinks. This was two fifty eight. Um, Shop Kids gave back two dollars and eight cent, making the co final cost fifty cent. And then they have like the little directions here to show you how to make it. But then I also got my Crystal Light. So last time I got the grape, which Conco Concord grape which I have not made yet, but this time I got fruit punch. So this was $2.48. Again, Shop Kids gave back $2.08, making the final cost $0.40. Cent. So drinks on drinks on drinks. I think I like getting a lot of this stuff because a lot of people that do follow me have families. And this is good to have when um you just want to make drinks for everybody and not just like a specific drink for yourself. Because, you know, Crystal Light, they have like the packs where you can just put it in the water bottle. But if you want to be a little bit more less selfish and help out and make it for everybody in the house then we have six pouches in here so i'm going to make some for my family tomorrow probably the next item that i have is also a bundle that i'm not sure is going to work but it should because these are the right product products um we have this degree the massage bar this was two dollars and 97 cent and then we also have the men's um, body wash, which is $5.47. Together, they were $8.44. Um, with the Shop Kick bundle, we got back $5.88, making the final cost two fifty six or one twenty eight dollars each. I do believe there was a, um, there was a deal with Fetch where you can get back a dollar. I'm going to try to submit, resubmit my ticket or my receipt and see if they'll give it to me, but they did not give it to me. So just be on the lookout if you don't get it. That may be why. The next item that I got, which I was really excited for, is the all-free moisturizer. Now, I think this deal is expiring today, so depending on when you see my video, most of these deals will last throughout the weekend. I don't normally go to Walmart through the week, so I don't do the midweek moneymaker. But, like, if you are always checking your account and just, like, following on with the breakdown and just checking your iBot account, some of these deals may spill over to next week. But this is the Neutrogena all free moisturizer sensitive skin this was eight dollars and 53 cents i had a three dollar coupon from coupons.com but there's also a three dollar coupon on the app so if you don't have if you don't print coupons on coupons.com which you should there's also an app because sometimes we be in a rush and we're like rushing out we may forget coupons with coupons.com the app all you have to do is purchase the item and whatever it is and then um upload your receipt um, you, they'll have you scan the barcode and um, they'll send the money straight to your PayPal. So this was $8.53. I used that $3.50 coupon, paid $5.53, but then I got back $2 from Checkout 51. I don't talk about Checkout 51 much because they don't have a lot of offers, but I will try to link below the link for Checkout 51 if you want to sign up. I don't have a referral code for that, but somebody may want to use it. And I also got back $4 from my body, making it completely free and a $0.47. Cent money maker quick quick commercial break quick quick commercial break so do you like to keep your water coat i know i do um this right here is the coldest water bottle i am an ambassador for coldest water bottle so the link um will be in description up description box below working on like i don't know why i'm getting nervous but it's just me talking to myself the link will be in the description box below and if you use the code diamond two at checkout you'll get 10% off. So I appreciate everyone who bought a bottle and clicked the link, but you have to make sure that you use the code so you can get the discount. Clicking the link is great, but please use the code. And I'm actually going to order another one because I want to get my name, DD Said So, on it. And it's true to what it says. It definitely keeps the water cold for days. Just put some ice in it. People be thinking, oh, I'm going to put the water in there and it's going to stay cold. Like, you have to put ice, y'all. Like, it's an insulated bottle, so it's going to stay at whatever temperature it is when you put it in there. So, put some ice in there and get you your coldest water bottle today and support me. Um, I got the Colgate toothpaste. So, I thought this was the right coupon. I thought this was the right toothpaste on my coupons.com app, but apparently it wasn't. I think I had redeemed the coupons.com app coupon for this already. And whatever other coupon I was looking at, maybe it was for the double pack or whatever. But even still, if you buy this at six ninety six, um, I bought it will give you back five dollars. If you have that coupon on coupons.com, you'll get three dollars back and it'll be a one oh four 
money maker, but I did not have that coupon, so it made the final cost one ninety six. And this next deal, which for the for the love of goodness, I hope that it resets. So swag bugs be doing the most. I went into wall. Okay, granted, I do take a lot of time in Walmart, so it's a good chance that it disappeared. But I got these um, when I was in Walmart. I scanned and I looked at my item, um, my my rebate on Swag Bucks. If you buy two of these, you'll get twelve dollars back. So these were six ninety six each, I believe. No, these were six forty eight a piece, making it. I didn't do the math because I did the math for six twelve. But anywho, it was like twelve dollars and some change, and you're supposed to get twelve dollars back but um when i went to go upload my receipt the offer was not there anymore so sometimes it disappeared and then it come back so i really hope by the time i get to work or later on in the day that it resets because right now i didn't pay 12 dollars and some change for some dry shampoo that i'm not going to use i mostly donate these but it's in my it's in my total, so I gotta tell you all about it. But just make sure, like, even if you have to check again at checkout, I have to start doing that for swag books. Cause swag books, uh, put it there and snatch it right back up. Um, but let's get to the total. Those are all of the items that I had for you today. Um, so the total for all of the items are four coupons, and I'm working on finding out my total before taxes because I know everybody's tax is different. But disclaimer, my tax is in the total with this one. It was $120.56. A lot of money. Um, those cereals was like almost $4 a piece. Um, I had a $25 gift card that I redeemed for my bottle from my last trip. But I was supposed to redeem another $25 gift card. So I'll get to that when I get to that. Um, so the total went down to $80.81. Most of you know, if you've been watching my videos, you know that I normally use Pay With Our Bada to purchase a gift card so that I can get kickback. So I went to go purchase a gift card. And I had $86 in my Ibotta earnings, so I found out that you can use your Ibotta earnings to purchase a gift card, which saves me so much more money, and, well not money, saves me so much more time with having to redeem a gift card and then send it to my email and then forget to print it because y'all know I'm forgetful. I could just use my Ibotta um, earnings to purchase the gift card at checkout. So I did purchase the gift card. Um... I got back $0.40 cent for purchasing the gift card. So the gift card was $80.81. So I got back a total of $64.01. If I would have got that $12 back for the Baltese, it would have been $76. But we're not going to cry with spilled milk. We kind of are, but we're not. So I got back $35.89 for all of the items on Ibotta. Plus, I got a $1 for hitting the Weekend Warrior. And my Weekend Warrior was only $1 for eight items. I clearly got more than eight items, but I know people who may or may not see my videos um, may need like 15 offers or 20 offers. So I try to give you as many options as possible. As well as I got, I hit the July level one. The, July's about to be over. I hit July level one and I got 50 cent for that. Plus the 40 cent was paid with Ibotta, making a final cost of $37.39 that I got back with Ibotta. For shop kicks, I got back 595 kicks for walking around the store and scanning the items, which is like a little over $2. But then I got back 5,250 kicks for the products that I did buy, making that 5,845 kicks, making that to money size $23.38, which I'm so excited because my last few shop kick re rebates was like, was not popping, but I got back $23.38 from shop kicks. I got back $2 on checkout 51 for the Neutrogena. And then I got back $1.22 on Fetch, $1 for buying the three cereals, plus um, some kickback bonus. Then I got $0.02. Cent on, I did get my $0.02 cent on Swagworks for uploading a receipt. But I do hope that they get it together and I can redeem my $12. If, I, if it does happen later, I'll pin a comment below saying that I did get my money <laughs> for the Baltese. But otherwise, I'm going to donate it anyway. So $64.01 that I got back, making everything completely free and a money maker because I didn't have to pay out of pocket. I used my Ibotta earnings. So just make sure that you remember that as an extra, I guess, tool that if you forget to get a gift card or you don't have your card, because remember, everything is happening through your phone. Like, I could have literally left my wallet at home and still paid for my, my stuff because I bought the gift card through my phone. So... 
this is all that I have for you today. All of my referral codes, description links, things of that nature will be below. I also, people who know me from TikTok, DD said so. I have a book club. We will be reading the coldest ones ever starting August 1st. So I will leave my I will leave my coupon email below as well as my regular everyday email below. So please email me at ddsadso64 at gmail.com if you want to be a part of the book club. I'm trying to get 10 people. Um, it may not seem like a lot, but 10 people is a lot to me. But I love y'all so, so, so much. I hope y'all have a great day on purpose. Why? Because Didi says so. Bye. Love y'all.